So the stages of high school. This will be the first video of my high school series. And I know I haven't been posting for a month, but I'm back, okay? And mm -hmm. um, for people who know about my old videos, I've deleted most of them. It's because it's embarrassing. And um, I can't believe this shit I did three months ago, you know? Mm -mm 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 -mm. So mm, let's get this shit started. Um, before I do this, I want to tell you guys that I'm going to be making more videos. Oh, my hands are so cool. Okay, I'm going to be making more videos for my high school series, including a back to school haul, man. Mm -hmm. I'm feeling like a beauty guru. Damn. Okay, I'm sorry if my hair bothers you, but for now, you can close your eyes and just listen. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm basing. So I'm basing this off the Canadian system because I am from Canada and we don't have four years, we have five years of high school. So it's like in grade 8 to grade 12, grade 8 to grade 12. And um, you know, let's start. So grade 8 is the time of awkwardness, it is time of awkwardness, especially social awkwardness. And you go into homeroom and you know, you look to the right, you don't know that person, you look to the left. You don't know that person. You look to the front. You do not know that person. And then you see the grade 12. They'd be having fun. You know, they'd be talking to each other like they've known each other for five years or something. And you just cry. Mm -hmm. You just cry. You know, you can't open the fucking lock. You can't even get through class on time. And you're just like, mm, damn school, damn life. What the hell is happening? And you know, this awkwardness does not rub off until... I'm telling you, until grade 9, I'm just saying, it might, you know, ease down, but it's still fucking awkward, because you've only known maybe a friend for like a maximum, maximum 10 months, maximum, okay? I mean, you could be like talking to that chick you never talked to back in grade 6, you know, that went to the same school as you, but you know, you have to make new friends, so, you know, you have to pop them the fuck up, go walk to that cute guy, walk to that cute girl, that you walk to that popular chick, you walk to that person that seems cool. You talk to them, okay? You have to make friends, okay? I mean, I talk to people, but I just don't have any friends, but I'm pretty sure you're cooler than me. So gray nine comes rolling around, and you feel like you are fucking ready for this shit. And you feel like, you feel like you are a lot better than those gray eights, and I'm telling you, you will feel like that. That's how I felt like, and I still feel like that. Mm-hmm. No, Green Nine comes and you go like, oh, I know you. Oh, I know you. We are friends. And you'd be like, oh, I know that teacher. Oh, I know where my locker is. I know all my classes. I be smart and experienced. When in truth, you've only been in this school for 10 months. Okay? I'm, I'm talking about September here, okay? Okay? You're practically a grade 8, okay? Okay? I wouldn't be too cocky at this point. But you could be a little bit cocky at the end has you been in the school for two years, you know? And uh, this is when your high school starts taking off like an airplane because you know a lot of people. You start to know pretty much everyone in your grade. And you know, you have friends, you have fun, you know? You're starting to get a hang of high school. I hope that your grades are doing well. If not, well, that's that's a shame. That, that's a shame. That's grade nine, okay? Grade 10! Grade 10! That's what I'm, that's what I'm going into. I'm going to be a grade 10. Man, I'm almost 15, girl. That's like a decade and a half. I should be dead by now. You know what? Why am I still alive? I, I, I'm, I'm, mm. And hey, have you noticed that my hair has grown longer? Like, if you watch my older videos, my hair is barely shorter. Look at this. It's getting longer. Mm-hmm. It's getting freaking longer. Okay, off topic here. So grade 10, I, you know, I'm not grade 10 yet, but I know people from grade 10. I know a lot of people from grade 10. So I'll tell you what grade 10 should be like if you're a normal person. You're going to be friends with a lot of people. You're going to have a lot of friends at this point. You're going to be, you know, you no longer have that stupid, immature feeling that you are too good for grade 8s. Because they thought that they were better than grade 8s. Mm -hmm. Just playing that out there. When grade 10, you'd be like, oh, I can be friends with grade 12. I can be friends with grade 8. You know, I'm going to have a lot of fun this year. Okay? You start joining more clubs. You start working harder. So grade 10, you're starting to grow up, girl. You're starting to grow up. And you know, grade 10, in my opinion, 
It's my perfect gear, girl. I've been waiting for this gear since I was nine or something. You know, it's my gear, girl. Mm -hmm. People start growing up and they start getting new experiences and they start to become mature people. And then grade 11 comes and you're just like, oh shit. I'm graduating next year. I need to get my fucking shit together. You know, grade 8 and grade 9, they were easy, okay? You didn't have to do shit. Grade 10 was relatively still pretty fucking easy. But grade 11, you have to get your shit together. Now you have to join clubs. You have to be a leader. You have to start doing well and stuff. And you also have to start getting on the good side of the teachers so they could write letters for you so you get into Harvard. <laughs> so grade 11 is a very hectic year. You should be very involved. If you're in grade 11 and you are not involved, you are doing something wrong with your life. Just kidding. You do whatever you want you want with your life. Mm. This is really tired, man. I should be studying. God damn. Look. A science 10 so I could do bio next year instead of science 10 and I should be And I should really be studying instead of doing this video, but you know, I promised myself that I'll make videos in August and uh, Here it is. Okay, so the last year of high school should be really fun um, You know most people they start relaxing a bit um, or some people either go really hardcore or they don't give a fuck at all anymore so Let's see which way you go. Some people be like, this is my year. I need to go good. I'm going to go all the way. We'll get 4.0 GPA. I'm going to get 98% average, you know? And by this time, you, you don't even, you know, you, you don't give a fuck about anything else now. Because if you're really that hardcore about school, shit's going to get a bit hard, you know? Colleges in a couple months, especially if you're, it's like at the end of the year. And the college is in a couple of months, and you have to prepare for that shit. Because you're gonna be a grade 8 again, a grade 8 again once you get into college. People will be like, oh, still a freshman. And you know, all those years of respect you gave are gone. Or you could be totally, totally opposite and not give a fuck and sleep in class, ditch class, fuck around. Um, and you know, you can have fun. Your last year of high school is quite interesting. Please post videos on YouTube as I would quite enjoy watching that while I enjoy my blueberries. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you guys look forward to my other videos. I would start posting much more often. Again, Tuesday and Friday. Yep. And um, hope you guys enjoy this. Bye-bye.